Hello everybody, and welcome back to Scrabble Connect Survival with me, Squidoodle! Welcome back guys to Larry Land and another wonderful day uh, inside of my jolly world, but uh, today's a bit of a sad day, okay, for multiple reasons. So, Scrap Mechanic patched the game yesterday, and there were some good patches, and there were some bad patches. Now, the good patches that they fixed the raid lag, we uh, no longer have crazy lagginess uh, when we're raiding, but the bad thing about this is they patched the farmers. You can no longer pick the glitchy farmers up. So, it's a sad day for Larry Land. We only have, um, like, three... Okay, we've got one farmer there, and uh, I think we've got two farmers left on the monster truck. So, oh no, wait. Oh no, they're the cows. <laughs> yeah, so we're running low on farmers, which I kind of, I was really sad at first because I thought, well, you know, Larry Land's going to be wrecked. We're going to have no employees, but we can still roll the employees and kind of trap them and uh, have them work in our theme park. So, you know, all is not lost. Um, but yeah, as you can see, uh, we've been busy collecting stuff for the theme park. I've uh, kind of sorted out my chest. Uh, sorting system so it's all linked up now uh, and all the chests are um, connected so it's really good for for making stuff everything's like in the same like area now which is super amazing I'm, I'm glad that I did it um, the craft pot annoys me because it's not central so I kind of planned this like so it's all central um, but yeah this guy is not and I really wish that this bit was the same as this bit. Like, just get rid of this bit. Why does this bit need to be longer? I don't understand. I hate I hate when, I hate when things are symmetrical. It really messes with my OCDs. But anyway, welcome back to Larry Land. Um, so, yeah, this is what we kind of crack it on with. So, um, Shadow kind of helped me with the railing. So, thank you, buddy. And uh, it looks pretty nice, actually. I've turned the grass, like, foliage down. Uh, so, we don't have that much grass coming through the bricks. But I've tried to make a little bit of a path. Now, we have got two... Two Garys at the front entrance, two for three sale, um, which is, you know, just an amazing scammy price. Gotta love two for free. Um, and we've also got these cash, cash registers, and I've connected them to a sensor. And it, like, sounds like Jaws. Is he moved? I swear he's moved. Oh, my goodness. I'm gonna have to, let me just, come on. Go. Go. I can't move him. He's too fat. I could move. Did I smash something then? Oh! Go further. That's it. Further. Come on. Don't be afraid of work. I think that's better. Is that better? Okay, you're kind of wonky now. <laughs> Come on. Bit more. There we go. Look at that. Okay, it's still wonky, but whatever. So, yeah, we've got some signs. We've got some lights here. We've got some plants. I've stolen a few more things. And, uh, yeah, Larry, I, I kind of, <laughs> so I added more pistons, and, yeah, it, it kind of broke, so, um, I kind of expected it, to be honest, I kind of, I added a lot more pistons, and the, the added more pistons, apparently, wrecks things, because it was it's just flimsy, but I'll, I'll show you the ride, um, a lot of people commented, so thank you all for the comments of the names of the new ride, a lot of people like Larry Launcher, but I'm still kind of sitting on the name. But anyway, I'll show you... Uh, I kind of... Okay, I'll try and show you what it's like. But as you can see, we've uh, we've got some tape on it. It's currently out of order. I just need to re-weld it and make it a little bit less <laughs> flimsy. <laughs> I don't know if there's a way I can actually get back on it to show you guys how bad it is. Let me just have a... Look. There we go. Come here. There we go. Are you ready? It's a little bit broken. <laughs> it's a little bit broken, guys. I kind of thought I could wiggle it back. But look, if you see the piston is like stuck inside on the outside, actually, not on the inside, on the outside of the Larry launcher itself. So it does go a lot higher now. But maybe this is how, you know, the Larry launcher was intended to be. I keep calling it the Larry launcher. I, I, I always set on the name Larry Launcher. I kind of like Larry Launcher. <laughs> Somebody said call it, um, what was it? Your financial status. <laughs> Something like that. Uh, but yeah, look at this. <laughs> it's so stupid. <laughs> it's absolutely ridiculous. Can you imagine this? We're like four people on it. Oh, it's a, it's, it's a heck of a ride, I tell you. It's an absolute heck of a ride. I wonder if I can get off. I'm going to get off and see if I can fix it. 
Ow, how did that hurt so much? Oh my goodness, look at this thing. <laughs> look at the kid. <laughs> oh no. Okay, anyway. So, um, yeah. What I'm going to do today is we're going to work on the next ride. Now, um, oh, come on, game. Don't kill me. Okay, that's fine. I'll just ragdoll. There we go. The Larry Launcher can stay like that. We're going to we're gonna work on it. But yeah, so I've made a new chest. Uh, today's episode, what we're going to be doing is working on a pirate ship. You know, the ones that swing like that. But I thought it'd be kind of epic to make it a little bit better. And instead of it just swinging like that, I'm going to kind of put a gas engine on it and make it go like that. I'm going to make it, you know, spin into it like a bear blade. So that's what we're going to be doing today. Now, the funny thing is, like, seven years ago, seven, eight years ago, when I first started uh, my channel, I did a Minecraft tutorial on how to build a pirate ship. So um, that's the last time, um, like, I properly... Well, it's not the last time I properly built a pirate ship, but that tutorial has stuck with me till now. And I'm kind of basing this pirate ship off of that tutorial so we'll see what happens we'll see uh, how this thing goes but um yeah i'm gonna wait till morning because it sucks building at night so uh, i'm gonna yeah let's just wait till morning actually while we wait i'm gonna open some more garment boxes uh i don't know how many i've got i've got one in my inventory but i'm just gonna see if i've got any more to actually open because it's been a while since we did any sort of Clothes, but I mean, I don't feel like I'm going to change my outfit. I don't think anything's going to be what we have on now. I've only got one. I thought I had more than one. Is that it? I was like, okay, let's do a fashion show. Now look, I've only got one. Really? Is that okay? Apparently, apparently I've only got, I've only got one. Can't really argue with that, can I? All right, let's just go stick it in anyway. I'm pretty sure that, um, yeah, I've, I've kind of got most of the clothes. Now, if we kind of look in the wardrobe, like, look at all the t-shirts. Got a few gloves, a few legs. You don't really get many uh, legs or hats in this game. So I'm hoping that they add more, uh, which would be kind of cool. But yeah, we definitely definitely need more more legs. <laughs> it's such a weird saying. But anyway, let's see. Let's see what we get. You can't actually still buy garments from Larry. So I'm not sure what happens when you unlock all the garments. Does like, are you, can you not like buy any from Larry anymore? Like what, what's, what's going to happen anyway? Oh, we've got more shoes. Really? Well, that sucks. I don't like these shoes. I got these shoes because it matches my gloves. <laughs> That's literally my, my reasoning for it. But uh, yeah, at least you guys will get to see what uh, the raids are like because they are pretty insane now. They are so smooth. Like, I, I jumped on after they patched it, and I was like, oh my goodness, this 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 raid. It kind of put faith back in me for the game, because I'm not going to say, like, I, I thought it was going to be lagging forever, but I thought it was going to take a while before they fixed it. But now, oh, it's so smooth, it's so smooth. So they've also patched um, the tape bots. Apparently, the tape bots actively run in the warehouse now, which is kind of scary, which... Uh, I'm not a big fan of, to be honest. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, apparently you can now do damage to the whip bots with the sock, as before you really could have. But anyway, here we go. Look at this. My most amazing defenses cannot be killed. And look, look, there's no lag. There's so many bots here, and there's literally no lag. It's great. It's so great. I'm so proud of them. They're improving all the bug fixes, apart from the farmers. The farmers one was a low blow. I feel like they watched my videos and they were, they were, they were coming after me with that one. I feel like, no, they didn't want Larry Land to exist, so they just thought they'd wreck it. Oh, look, we've got loads of bots. Can't come in. Ramps are overpowered. Please don't nerf the, don't patch the ramps. <laughs> please, please, not my ramps. This is like my perfect defense, all right? Do whatever you do. Don't come after my ramps. I like how these guys just... They just don't even bother anymore. They kind of see the ramps, and it's like they can't see the crops, so they just don't bother. It's so weird. Anyway, let's just smash the rest of these guys up. It's free metal, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, I kind of thought about putting an automatic collector uh, around the edge of the wall to, like, just come around every night after we finish killing. Uh, I feel like that would be kind of a cool idea, because it's not like we need to go and harvest any of these bots, because they're always here. <laughs> They're just here every night. I can't get rid of them. Anyway, I'm going to collect all the metal, and I'll see you guys in the morning. So it might be quite fun, actually. I know I was on about getting an automatic collector to run across here. So I was actually thinking we could do a saw blade uh, that runs across the top of these walls uh, and just, just, just goes along, chops the heads off, 
you know, we could we probably get to test that out in a recent ep in, a, in the next episode or recent episode. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's get on with today's ride. So let me let me know what you guys want me to do in terms of Larry Land. Do you want me to do um? Do you want me to do like a video on Larry's Land and then a video on doing other stuff, building and uh, really just getting on with my base? Should I do one every episode like of Larry's Land, you know, create a new ride, or should I kind of switch it up a bit? Let me know down below. As I say, I'm gonna carry on building this theme park because I, I really want it to be a thing. But if you don't want it every episode, then I can switch it up. So just just let me know. I'm easy doing whatever. But yeah, let's crack on with this. Pirate swing. Now, um, yeah, <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. You're gonna see me trying to build a pirate ship. So we got uh, tons of wood here. We've also got ourselves uh, some of this unsort of processed wood uh, in case we run out. But yeah, let's get building. So I don't really need any of my tools yet. So let's just fill the whole bar full of this stuff so we know how much we actually have left. So let's begin. I'm gonna kind of do like the under. The underbelly of the beast now. I don't really know how wide uh, we're going to make this thing. I'm just kind of going to go with it and, uh, yeah, see see what the, the dimensions are like. See see what size we have to make it. Because I don't really want this to be like a, a teeny tiny ride. But then again, it doesn't want to be too big because, like, the gas engines might not be able to power it. So we really need to, um, yeah, sort of think about how big we're going to make this bad boy. So... Um, yeah, we'll just have to wait and see. Because I was thinking about putting it on, like, a bearing-powered bearing engine, but after... Oh, why did I just do that? I've just deleted that, and that's connected to it. Yeah, but after my um, track record with losing my vehicles uh, with bearing-powered stuff, it's just not worth it. Because, like, I don't want to spend ages building this and then go to start the ride, and it just flings away... Like all my previous builds have with bearing powered. I don't know whether I just got them, them on too high for the bearings. And that's why I lost all my vehicles. But um, yeah, I, I really should do an episode of me going out and trying to find my lost vehicle. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to build it up in this sort of ship. I'm just going to keep going uh, out and then get in the basic sort of boat ship. I reckon after this layer... We're going to probably start going up a little bit more horizontal. But as I say, I don't really want to make it too perky and too small. It needs to ha it needs to look the part. And if this turns out well, you never know. We might actually just make a, a pirate ship to actually sail. Sail the seven seas on, even though there's like literally nothing out there. Apart from oil and uh, clams. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll, we'll see what happens. But let's start, I think... Should I start making it three... I might start making it three wide now. Should we do that? Let's see how that looks. Um, okay, let's let's go out. Is that gonna look too much? Okay, I kind of want because I kind of want to like, you know, do different shapes. So we'll try this and we'll see what this is like. Actually, let's let's go up a little bit more and then we'll go we'll go up like that. So it's giving it a bit more of a shape. And then I think I'll do the same on the other side. Well, we're going to have to do the same on the other side. I'm going to have to keep switching back and forth because the thing is, if I get too creative with one side, I'm literally not going to be able to follow the pattern. So, yeah, I've kind of <laughs> kind of got to take this slow. But, um, yeah, I want to do it on camera just so you guys, like, know that I haven't just, you know, I don't know, spawned in or, like, looked, looked at some other person's boat idea or what have you. But... Yeah, this is looking alright. So, um, the, the back is going to be kind of square. Um, because boats... They don't really like the front. The front the front's kind of long and narrow. And then the butt... The, the back of the butt's kind of like... It's got a little bit of a butt. A little bit, a bit, a little bit of a butt butt. So, yeah, let's start working on the front. I'm just going to keep mapping out the shape. So, let's just do this. Like this. And bringing this out a little bit longer. And, uh... Yeah, we'll see how this goes. I'm kind of worried that it's not going to look like a bot, so you guys will have to <laughs> bear with me here. But, uh, yeah, let's carry on going, and I'll catch up with you guys uh, in, like, five minutes when this thing's got a little bit more of a shape to it. Okay, okay, it's sort of getting there. Uh, yeah, let's let's start bringing this up here. So I'm going to bring... I'm going to bring this out like so, and then I kind of need to just... Be brave and just bring this up and then 
kind of like bring it back here and see how it looks because we need to work on this ship so yeah let's let's do this we can always chop this off uh, let's do this up here chop this off here and then we'll bring the rest up now this won't look perfect but it will once I'm done. <laughs> That's brave. Some brave statement, isn't it? This will look perfect. It'll look absolutely beautiful. I played a lot of Sea of Thieves, so um, I'm hoping my my boat knowledge will be good enough for this. So we need to bring it up one more. Have I got it on the lift? Oh yeah, I do. <laughs> Thank goodness. Can you imagine if I built this onto the ground? Oh, that would that would that would not be good. That would not be a good thing. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna bring this the same height. So we'll do the same on this side. Okay, so it's getting there, it's getting there, it's getting there, it's getting there. So I will bring this out. I'm just gonna kind of, I don't know, just just kind of, just kind of work with the shapes now. See where we're at. We've still got a decent amount of wood, which I'm super glad of. Uh, let's bring this up here, bring this up here, bring this up here, bring this up here. So my worry for this build is not being well, not it not swinging because it's going to be too heavy. That's that's my only sort of worry. But <laughs> let's hope, <laughs> let's hope that it it will swing. <laughs> Can I chop these down? Because I want to kind of round this off. There we go. Okay, we'll bring this down like this. We'll bring this out more. I kind of like making boats. I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of fun just just working on the ship and stuff. Can you imagine if I built one of these? And uh, sailed around with it. That would be that'd be pretty cool. Not gonna lie, I, I kind of like that. I just wish that fuel would be easier to get. But they have tweeted out saying that they are working on uh, a way to kind of uh, collect fuel automatically, which would be pretty amazing. That would be that would be pretty great. I'm not gonna lie, I'd love that. So yeah. Creations like this will be possible once we get, obviously, automated fuel. Like, I guess this isn't really going to be possible for, for the time being. But that's a good, good ship of a boat at the front. I uh, I dig that. Maybe we could do with tweaking up some of the edges, but um, it's symmetrical-ish, I think. Yeah, it's symmetrical. Uh, I'm going to leave it for now. Let's get rid of them, too. Uh, let's get rid of them too. And we will work on the butt because the butt isn't looking very butt-like. <laughs> Look at this thing. This thing's great. So again, we kind of need to be harsh. And that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm just going to make it harsh. We're just going to bring it up. I don't think this thing's big enough. I'm just going to say it right now. I, I kind of made it. I think this is too small. But, you know... It's a ride, so it's not uh, an accurate representation of a, a pirate ship. <laughs> this is a ride at the end of the day. We can't really spend too many materials making it look all elegant and, and, and absolutely perfect. But, yeah, I'm happy with it. Looks good. Okay. So, butt shape is on point. I don't think it's too big. I think it's kind of nice. It's a nice butt. There we go. And then we'll just... Uh, yeah, why not? We'll just bring them up like that. Bring them up like that. And it's a little bit bigger at the back, but that's fine. And it's obviously we need to work on the shape here because, <laughs> you know, boats just don't get, like, flattened like that. So we'll we'll sort this out here. But it, I don't know, it's nice working on them. Um, it's nice working on it. Look at it. It looks amazing. We're getting some shape in there. I'm digging it. And I, I kind of wanted to do this real time as well. I didn't really want because normally in my videos I'm like okay I'm gonna do a build and I'll see you guys in a second and then I'll be back but I thought you know what let's let's have a change of pace and uh, we'll do this real time and you guys can see how much time it actually takes to make a boat <laughs> all right so that's the main sort of body done um, I could make the shape a little bit more elegant, but we've got lots to do still. So let's crack on. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the shape of the uh, the kind of like flooring, whatever you call it. I don't know really what you call it. I guess it's just called the flooring, like the inside of the ship. I'm going to change it to like a light wood because I feel like if we just use too much of this color wood, then it's just going to blend in. So I'm going to kind of pop. There we go. It now has a nice floor 
And if I was using this, you know, actually out on the water, I'd hide, like, all the stuff down here. I was actually thinking about using farmers. Like, if I did make this, uh, like, you know, to actually go out on the water on, I could hide farmers in the bowels of the beast. And uh, you, you wouldn't see them. And it'd float perfectly. So... I, uh, I might keep my two little farmers over there and uh, use them for maybe a boat in the future. But uh, yeah, let's start working on some other stuff. So I'd absolutely love it if we... Oh, we could. We could do that. I was thinking we could use trees as the masts. We could cut them down. Should we do that? Ha. Oh. Hold on. We might be able to do this. Let me go chop a tree and then let's see what the situation is. Because how cool would a proper tree look in this? And it might be a little bit too heavy. I'm going to test it anyway. I think I have a tree already in the water somewhere. Where is it gone? Did it, did it, did it, did it disappear? Oh, I think this is what's left of it. Oh, no, here it is. Oh. Yes. Okay, that's great. Now I don't have to mess about chopping stuff. Let's go and uh, weld this to my boat and then see what the situation is. Oh my goodness, this is going to be way too big, isn't it? Look at the state of this. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that... If it was bigger, it, it would be uh, a nice idea. But unfortunately, uh, this is a ride. And it's not a pirate ship. So yeah, that, that idea has kind of gone out the window. But I do like it. It's, it's a good concept. It just wouldn't really work on here. Okay, let's move on. Let's get rid of the... Let's get rid of it. Why, would I, why can't I get rid of it? Oh god, no. Don't say I've broken it. There we go. Okay, get off. Get off me boat. I can't get out. I'm stuck in my own boat. What is life? Can I... Ugh. Okay, that was not pleasant. <laughs> I don't want to do that again. Okay, let's just weld it to this. This random piece of junk. Oh, God. Ah, not on my boat. Okay, great. So I had an idea as well for a water, like a log flume using logs. But that's that's like another idea way down the line. But anyway, we need to get cracking. Uh, we got stuff to do. So let's quickly work on the top bit of this boat. And uh, I'll catch up with you guys in the morning when it's light. Because it's getting dark and it's going to start getting really sucky. <laughs> it gets super annoying when it's uh, when it's coming this time. You can't see anything. All right, it's morning time. Time to crack on with the boat. Uh, I've added like a different color wood around this bit. Don't know if I like it or not. Um, and I've also added some wood up here. But again, I don't know if I like it or not. Uh, I'm running out of normal like processed wood. So... I'm, I'm trying to switch the color palette up a little bit too. Anyway, it's time for the masts. So what we're going to do is I'm going to go back to this color. And I'm going to hope that I've got enough. So we're going to go up quite a bit. I don't know whether to go one or make it three wide, to be honest. So I'm going to make sure this is in line two. Like so. Because I kind of want the mast to be a bit chunkier than that, maybe. I don't know. Should we? Should we? I don't know. Um... I need to make this one a little bit bigger, but I can't because it's not welded to the ground. So I'm going to have to try and do it this way. Okay. Do I want to make it too big? Do they match? Do ships, masts, m m are they the same? I don't even know. Let me have a look. I'm making this too accurate. Well, I'm not. It's not accurate at all, but <laughs> I want it to be sort of accurate. So the back one is always definitely taller than the front one. So I'm happy with that. Okay. So let's start building the sails. Again, I'm not a pirate ship, like... <clears throat> I'm not a pirate ship. <laughs> I'm not, like, a pirate ship designer connoisseur. Excuse me, I'll be Um But we're going to try and make it somewhat, you know, sail-like. We're going to try our best to make it look like it's got a little bit of movement in it. So, yeah, let's go and bring... Hold up, how am I going to do this? Uh, like that. And then we need to go up. Like so, and then this wants to be wider, no? Yes, this wants to be wider, like so. I might make it a little bit tall. I want to see how much room we've got left. Let's step back. <laughs> yeah, it needs to be a lot more taller than that. Okay, at least I know where we stand. I wish I, I could, like, you know, build this. I wish I could just fly around. It's so awkward building it like this. <laughs> okay, let's build it to there. And then it needs to go in. Okay, we can still go high, which is nice. And then I'm going to need to come around the back of it. And I need to build it in. Can I come? Can I? Yeah, there we go. Nice. And then we need to go like that. And then like that. And then like this. Like this. And then is that the same? I don't know if I like the look of that. Hmm. 
Something needs change in here, guys, and I don't know what. Something definitely needs change in here. This, it needs to be, I think it needs to be a bit wider here. So we can bring this out like this, and then this needs to go wider. Do the same on this side here, so that looks a wee bit better. Yeah? Yeah, 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 yeah. I kind of like that too. Yeah, I like that too. Okay. Uh, bring this down. It's like got a little bit of... A little bit of air in the old sails, you know what I mean? Like that. Get rid of that. Yes. Beautiful. Beautiful sail. I'm digging it. All right. So, we need to make the top a little bit wide too. And then we need to do the same on the back. And we will have ourselves one good looking pirate ship, I reckon. Do you know what? Quite happy with this. It's looking well. It's looking pretty good. I like it. We haven't even worked on the swinging part yet. I need to hurry up. I'm, I'm taking way too long in there on this pirate ship. I also need some seats as well. Like, we don't have a way for people to get on or off. Oh, my goodness. Okay, how far are we off the bottom? One, two, three. Start on the fourth. Got to go quick here. There, there. Start on the fourth. Make it, make it wide. Make it, make it a wide, boy. And then go like this. And then like this, and then... Okay, I'm hoping this is the same. Got a problem. I can't reach the top of this sail. I can't. I'm too... The lift's... Ah, what do I do? 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 What do, I, do? I need a seat. I need to get a seat. Oh, I love seats. Okay, now we should be able to finish this. So I need to go... In and up. If I can move my um, body out of the way. This is so awkward. Ah! Oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay, we'll, we'll, we'll finish it from down here then, maybe. Maybe, possibly. All right. I mean, it's not 100% perfect. I kind of want that back sail to be bigger. Um, yeah. Yeah, no. Yeah. It's, I think it's wide. Is it wider? No, it's not wider. It's just this one needs to be bigger. Okay. I'm going to have to fix it. I can't. I want to do this right. Okay, guys. Just, just. This is, this is how it's going to be. <laughs> I've spent way too long on this for it to, like, not be how I exactly want it. So, let's bring this up. One, two. One, two. One, two. Do the same on this side. There we go. That looks a little bit better. Still not 100%, but I'm a lot happy with that. I'm a lot happy with that. I think it needs to go in at the top a little bit more, but it is what it is. Let's, uh, yeah, let's start putting some seats on it, and then I need to start thinking about how to actually power this thing. So my, oh, my sort of idea is, I don't know where to put it, actually. We might just put it, um, which way around does this look better? Here we go. That kind of looks, I'm happy with that. I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. This looks an absolute mess at the back. <laughs> Because I've added bits and I haven't fixed it, but it is what it is. We'll fix it soon. Anyway, so what we need to do is we need to have a swinging mechanism. Now, this is going to have to be quite tall, you know, because this thing needs to get off the ground. So let's keep building it up. Is that going to be tall enough? I think that probably that might be okay. I'm going to build it just a little bit taller and then it needs to come across like so. And yeah, then we need like the whole swinging mechanism. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a bearing on a, um, we might put a piston so we can lower the ride so people can get on. And then, yeah, I don't know where to attach it to either. I don't know whether to attach it to the mast or I guess that's going to look the best, isn't it? If we attach it to a mast, the only problem is that it's going to be on an angle either way. Like, this is never gonna... It's never gonna be straight. How do they do it on rides? Looks like they have two anchor points, like, coming from, like, up and then up. But that doesn't... That's not gonna look... That's not gonna look good, is it? We need it to look pirate -y. No, I don't... I want it to look like it's just a pirate ship swinging away. <laughs> just swing it on by. Hmm. Maybe I put a third one in. Let me just... Let me, let me just... Let me just see what's happening here. Now, if old Squiddy Beans... Puts a third mast in. Ooh, that could look good, actually. That could look real good. Uh, uh, yeah, uh. <laughs> no! I need to be taller! Why did they make the, like, the dudes, like, two foot tall? Don't understand. Oh, no, that's messed up. Okay, so... We need... I'll test it with a bearing... For now. And... And then, yeah, we'll see what it's like. So, we need one bearing on it. Uh, and we'll see if that's going to be tall enough. And then we can always make some adjustments uh, with pistons and stuff like that. But for now, let's just get this thing swinging. Okay, so I've put the, the bearing on. I'm not sure how much you guys can see. You can probably see a little bit better than me. 
because, um, you know, the sun's in my eyes here, so... Oh, goodness. Okay, I think I need to... Was that it? Oh, she's up! She's up in the air! <laughs> oh, yes! All right, all right. I'm not mad. That's, that looks pretty good. This this pole looks weird, though, doesn't it? I feel like we need to make this pole look a little bit more beefier. It's just like one tiny, tiny pole. <laughs> I mean, it's Larry Land. I know it's Larry Land, but you gotta make it look like it's physically possible, I guess. I mean, you don't have to, but I kind of want to. I, I can't believe it's night time again. I have to wait another day, well, another night, so I can finish this thing, but tomorrow we will get it finished. So while you, um, or while I wait, should I say, we need to make ourselves some seats. So let's see, let's see how many sheets we have. I should probably go back to the old warehouse and get some absolute rubbish seats. Yes. Let's go see how much they are. All right. Back here. How much are the old seats? Oh, look at these. These are perfect. So we've got wood and um, circuit boards. So that's actually not much. So I might just work with that. These are perfect seats. Look at them. They're, ah! They look like pirates. Uh... Like old scraggly pirate uh, outfits. Look at them using like an old seat and a coat hanger. And I mean, they don't really look that pirate, but they look they look like something Larry would use. <laughs> so yeah, let's uh, let's head back get some materials, uh, fight the raid, and I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, well I'm crafting some normal seats because I don't have any of the unrefined wood. Uh, it's just easier for me to, to make the normal seat, which is kind of weird. <laughs> But uh, there we go. So let's jump on the pirate ship. So I might actually make some kind of entrance to get up on here. Because obviously this isn't a great way. And I've just started losing frames. And it's got really choppy and I don't know why. Odd. I don't know if it's something that I'm crafting. But uh, yeah, anyway. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Let's go and press this on here. Uh, actually, we'll bring this in front. And we'll bring this in front. And then we'll have them all, like, road at the back. So, yeah, what we're going to do is connect all these up now. So, we need an engine on this thing, which I believe I've got one here. Uh, gas engine will test out and see if this uh, can actually handle it or not. We will f we will find out. We'll put the engine in the captain's quarters because uh, it's precious cargo. Let's connect this up to a button, actually, and we'll have it up here for now. And then we'll connect this button to the main seat. And then, yeah, we'll connect this to the engine. And we'll see how this goes. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah, and obviously we need the, the bearing. <laughs> the bearing to the engine. That would help. And, uh, yeah, let's try and get some fuel. And we'll see. Oh, I don't know if this is going to work or not. I, I feel like it needs to be taller because I feel like it's just going to go and then smash its front end. But we'll find out. So do I have any fuel? I hope I've prepped some fuel. <sighs> have we prepped any fuel? There's some in here. We can make like five. Have we got any more? I've got ten here. Any more? I've only got ten. I don't know how long ten is going to really last. I should have should have gathered a lot more fuel before this because... Uh, yeah, I feel like we're going to need it. We have got a few batteries, so if, if that doesn't go to plan, we can always try to put batteries on there, but we'll see how it goes. So let's go jump on. We can actually get on from here. There we go. Oh, this looks so cool. Oh, I've done such a good job. No, I'm not going to... I don't want to, you know, kind of toot my own trumpet, but I feel like I've nailed this, guys. We've, we've actually nailed this build today. Okay, we'll pop some fuel in. Pop it on max. All right. So this is... I don't know what we call it, but it's the pirate ship ride. Let's... Oh, my goodness. This is on max as well. That's on max. Are you joking? Come on. Come on. I'm, I'm like building momentum. <laughs> Come on. Go over! No, it's not doing it! Here! Come on! I wanted to go all the way! Give it some! This is the one. This is the one. This is the one. <laughs> it's not powerful enough. It's too heavy. Oh! Come on, you bugger! 
Ah, oh, it's not doing it. Okay, I don't want to waste any more fuel. Uh, how much do we go through? Oh, we're through six fuel? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. We need to have a think about this. Uh, thrusters would work, but the only problem with thrusters is that's probably going to take even more fuel. Um, but I do have a spare thruster to test, so we'll give it a test and we'll see what thrust thruster power is like. There we go, I've got a level, level 5 thruster. We'll see how the thruster compares to the engine. Remember, guys, always put your thrusters on a switch. <laughs> Hello, not the hard way. Okay, take the fuel out. Um, obviously, pirates had thruster power back in the day, so... Connect this to the button and the button to the seat. And then we'll chuck it on. Let's see how much, how long three fuel lasts us. Do you think this is going to be better than the gas engine? We'll see. Oh, my God. I was on full! No way, dude! Okay, that's not a viable option either. Wow! Okay, game. How am I gonna do this then? We could try battery. I just don't think battery's gonna be able to do it. I really don't. Battery has more torque, I think, so we'll give it a we'll give it a whirl. Okay, we could we need to upgrade it really. Do we have any more component kits? I hope we do. Alright, I've got the component kits. Let's go and test out this uh, this battery engine. And then if that doesn't work, then maybe we'll have to put two bearings on it and try and power them both. Like maybe put a gas engine on one and uh, an electric on the other. Oh my goodness, look, that's what's lagging my world. Larry Launcher is lagging my world that is that is that is definitely what's doing it here okay let's upgrade this there we go let's chuck some batteries in it let's put it on maximum and then bada boom bada bing okay battery wait what okay battery test let's go is that doing anything really that's doing nothing at all oh my goodness come on battery Wow, that is poor. This pirate ride is, uh, it's really doing a number on me here. Okay, well, let's turn it off. Um, let's take this out, and I'll have to go with option number two, which is putting a, another bearing on it. So let's, let's, uh, let's remove that. So let's put another one of you on, and then another one of you on. And then we need to re... Uh, we need to make this a little bit taller again, and then re-weld it, and then we'll try again, guys. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Let's try this again. Battery and gas. Obviously, uh, I should... Uh, two gas engines would do this, but I only have one. Uh, so let's connect this up to this. Uh, connect this up to that. And this should, fingers crossed, work. I'm hoping. It's going to be a short ride. We only have, like, four gas... Got a lot of batteries, but we only got four gas, so turn that up. Put this in here, turn that right up, and let's test this out. Please work. Are they both going the right way? Yes, okay. Here we go. Test number two. Oh my goodness, what's happening? Oh my goodness, what's happening? What? What? <laughs> what is happening there? I think it's the weight. I think the weight's way too much for this thing. Oh no. Oh, no, my dreams of a pirate ship ride. Eh, what do we do? 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 Okay, so we're using the controller now, and it's already starting to shake a little bit. Okay, it's starting to get a little bit more um, stable. Here we go. Oh, I didn't really want to use the controller, but we're going to have to, I'm afraid. It's, it's my last hope. The engines have failed me. So we're going to slam it on 360. And then uh, we're going to just start it off on, like, medium and see if this works. Because it's like my last hope. Oh, God. It's not getting off the ground. Look at the bend. Oh, no, guys. Come on. Come on, pirate ship. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, oh no, 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 no. This is what happened to Big Bear. This is what happened to Big Bear. No. 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 Okay, I'm going to have to, like... I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to get rid of it. I'm gonna have to get rid of it. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Pirate shit. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, stop, 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 stop. <laughs> That's what happened to Big Bertha. But it went flying. 
Oh my goodness. Okay, we, we're gonna need a change of plan, guys. Change of plan is in fact needed because uh yeah engines engines are failing me and so are the bearings so um yeah i need to have a little think okay i've got the fuel we've got 20 fuel uh this is gonna be a one take thing i don't know how i'm gonna make this more efficient but let's whack it in there there we go we've got 10 left we've got some batteries uh i've got more batteries in my house but i'm gonna leave it there for now okay let's give the pirate ship and, and go. Let's see what it does. Come on, please work. Please work. Here we go. Come on. Yes. Okay, we're getting some speed. It's fine. Come on. Oh, it's nearly there. This is the one. This is the one. This is the one. Come on. Over. No. <laughs> Come on, Jeff. Are you serious? Maybe it were better if I had a seat. Wait, let me just... How much fuel did we use? How much fuel did we use there? Let me have a... Let me, let me, let me, let me, let me, six and four. I got one more... One more idea. One more idea. Okay. Um, I need a seat. I'm not going to steal that one. Do we have enough for a seat? I need a seat. Yeah. Okay. All right. We're going to change this up. Oh, no. Oh, no. I didn't want to... <laughs> Can I cancel it? Can I, can I cancel it? <laughs> no! So we're gonna do like, we're gonna put him, uh, yeah, up and then down and then up and then down. We're gonna, we're gonna get some momentum going. I don't know what, what how we could even do this more efficiently. We don't have anything powerful enough. Even the thruster won't work. You know what? Maybe that's it. Maybe that's what we need to do. Maybe that's what we do with the last 10 fuel. Maybe we just get the, maybe the thruster will tip this bad boy over the edge. There we go. That's what we need to do. I've cracked it. I've actually nailed it. It. that to that and then we put the rest of the fuel in here chuck it on max and then this is it this is it i've made them seats it's probably a waste but whatever it's gonna come in somewhere okay here we go the wrong seat i'll put this last seat on here we go come on pirate ship so if you do have any like um suggestions of how to make this more efficient then let me know but let's just go for it come on please work oh yes Woo! <laughs> yeah, buddy, it works. Oh my goodness. The pirate ship works. What does this look like for first person? Oh. Oh. Bleh. Yes. This is amazing. <laughs> Take that, Larry Launcher. We've done it. Oh, we're out of fuel. Oh, and it's spinning around now. Oh, it's still going with the thruster. No, it can't do it with the thruster alone. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, we need to sort that that out there. <laughs> That's not really doing anything. <laughs> but that is the pirate ship. It looks brilliant. I can obviously jazz it up in between episodes, but it's taken a while. It's taken a long time to build this pirate ship and make it look like a pirate ship. We still had some fuel left in the thrusters, but look at it. In all of its glory, I am pretty, pretty pleased with that. It's going to take a few adjustments to get it properly optimized and working. Um, but I think we've done well today. The Larry Launcher was a few pistons and, uh, you know, that was it. This has been a full-on build. Like a full-on build. Okay, let's get rid of these. Get rid of these. Connect this to this. Connect this to this. So we can actually control it now. Full power. Full power's not doing anything. Them electric engines are absolutely crap. <laughs> They're so crappy. I'm trying to get this thing, like, upright. Like, level. I'm having to hit it with a hammer. <laughs> oh, dear me. But I'm happy with that. I think that's legit. It looks amazing. I think I've done a good pirate build. Obviously... I really want it just to go faster and faster, but I don't have, like, the materials. But I think, to be honest, that's a good ride. I think we've added we've added, it, added a good ride well to the park today. I think it's great. It's, it's worked a lot better than this thing. <laughs> but anyway, guys, uh, in between episodes, I will sort Larry's launcher out. And also, the pirate ride will we'll try and make it more efficient. I don't know how. Leave some comments down below. Uh, but we'll make it look a, a little bit better. We need to start dressing these areas up around here as well to make it feel uh, a little bit more park-like. But hopefully you have enjoyed this episode. Hopefully you have enjoyed the pirate build. If you have, smash like. And uh, I will see you uh, not tomorrow, but the day after for another Scrappy. Bye!